Hi and welcome everyone, Lisa from the Relativity of Paper. Today I'm going to be sharing with you a case belated birthday card. We're going to be using Crafting Desert Divas Autumn Wishes Oh Nuts I Forgot Your Birthday Sentiment and Acorn Stamp from that set and we're also going to use this cute little acorn die cut. We're going to be using this banner die from Crafting Desert Divas flag banner die set. Great set of dies to have to add sentiments to your cards. You can also add use these to create fun little elements um, to add to your cards like we're doing with this card today. I'm also going to be using one of the pieces from the brand new Crafting Desert Divas Tag Shaker dies. This was just released in August and we're going to be using this square. And the thing that I love about this set is that it has a lot of fun elements. You can create pulls for mini albums. Um, you can just create so many things with this and it even has a cute little bow. But one of the things I love most are the square and the circle have double stitching. And what that means is that when you cut it out, your dot, your cutout will be stitched, but your negative will be stitched also. So that's great for creating shakers and peekaboo cards. So here we're going to be using a four and a quarter by five and a half inch card base. In white and then we're going to be using a four and one eighth of an inch by five and three eighths of an inch matte craft cardstock and that's going to be our mat and we're going to stamp both of these so um, I don't want to assemble them just yet we're also using die cuts with a view pattern paper the glitter basic stack right there you see it's a six by six paper pad that I bought um, a couple of weeks ago so I'm excited to use it so we're using our mini misty here and we're just stamping up our sentiment that's on the inside of our card called your birthday and I'm going to add one little acorn down in the corner there we're going to stamp that twice that's why I love my mini misty I can do repeated stamping and not have to worry about am I off or am I going to mess up my paper so now we're going to add our oh nuts I forgot sentiment to our craft card stock this is the matting that's going to go on our card base stamping it twice and I'm using memento ink and rich cocoa for both the inside and the outside of the card so now we're just going to use our ATG gun and put some adhesive on the back of our craft cardstock and adhere it to our card base making sure that we have it nice and centered and that we get a good bond between the two pieces of paper one of the things that I try to always emphasize is to give to really press down on your um, paper on your pieces of paper so that you get create a good bond between your two pieces of paper that way you don't have to worry about your card falling apart it's always very important to me to sometimes I will even take my little um, folding tool and go over the pieces that I have added adhesive to just to make sure that I have that strong bond. So here we have the banner dies that we cut out and I'm going to run them through my little Xyron sticker machine so that I can add some adhesive to the back of them. I love this little machine. I picked it up at Walmart and um, been using it ever since. I've had it for a couple of years and I absolutely love it. It makes adding adhesive to your die cut pieces so simple. Now this is the small one and the opening on it is only one and a half inches wide. So keep that in mind when you're buying it that if you ever want to do something large you're not going to be able to do it with this one. You probably need to get the five inch Xyron or even larger. So now we're just centering up our little banner dies that we've done and we're going to add some 3D foam to the back of our white squares and we're going to center this, start with the center square and then work out. That makes it a little bit easier. We're going to add our acorns into our Xyron machine, run them through, pull them out and add them to our card and we are done. It's that simple. I love how clean this card is. Thank you for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this video and be sure to check me out at www.therelativityofpaper.com and if you subscribe to our email by September 15th you'll be entered to win a $50 gift card from the store of your choosing. I really appreciate you guys and I hope you have a great week. Thanks.